Disclaimer, this is audio horror fiction. If darkness or the creatures it holds scares you, leave now. Still listening? Good. Then let's begin. I came from a poor family that abandoned me. The moldy and cracked corridors of beige wood flanking yellowing walls encompassed my vision as the rest of my female peers fall into the line for the toy littered common room. One of my friends managed to find a foreclosure notice crumpled in the trash can yesterday, so we knew that we'd get to know the streets soon. We could hear Miss Way, our teacher and mother, crying on the mattress in the front office. She didn't look like us, but she loved us all nonetheless. A bell rang. We saw Miss Way walking quickly to the door, talking in American language for a while, then coming to the common room. Miss Way entered, fakely smiling and crying at the same time. She spoke through staggered whimpers. A rich businessman is here to adopt you all. We all looked at each other, some putting down lettered blocks and some putting down weathered books. I translated her words for the younglings, and they all nodded happily. The old and musty room suddenly felt much warmer, and we all collected our personal items. Bow Bow, I'm sorry, Miss Way said over and over again, her age and sadness curling her words into pain and guilt, kissing and hugging us on the way out of the door into the smog. When we all reached the road, we could no longer see the orphanage. A suited, glasses-wearing man stood in front of a large bus, gesturing us to enter. Being the only one able to read American, I was the only one able to cry. Fun Toys Production Factory Transport Bus. The younger ones looked at me with shining, hopeful smiles. I smiled back. Thank you all so much for listening. If you enjoyed this story, leave a like and subscribe to help feed the dark machine. This is the first part of a new series I'll be doing on my channel. It's Creepy Pasta Short Horror. Currently, I am working 16 hour shifts at my job, so my videos have been a bit late. I'm sure you noticed. Once my schedule becomes less appalling, this series will be moved to just Tuesday and Thursday. For the rest of this week, however, this series will fill in for the creepypasta slash reddit horror stories. I look forward to next week being a little more open, and I hope that you enjoy this new series. Let me know in the comments below if there's anything else that you would like to see.